pre-op completing the forms and realize you have a dependent. Welcome back to my channel. Um, yeah, today's the day. I'm going to have my thyroid removed. They haven't marked me up yet, but I'm in my hospital now. I'm literally in the hospital. Yeah, and look at this. Hold on. So I'm going to try and get me literally going up to the surgery and then it's literally going to be the post recovery stuff. So yeah, got my hair taped as well. The nurse is probably looking at me like I'm crazy. But yeah, I'll see you guys soon. So guys, I've snuck out of my room and I'm literally just going to give you a quick tour. This is what I'm doing right now. That's where I am. And that stuff. Stop. Make sure you clean your hands. COVID. And this is the wall that I'm on. So I've just got to walk through here. I said I'm going for a quick walk, and they were laughing like, they looked at me like, is she trying to escape? bedroom that's what it looks like they're probably looking at me like I'm crazy but this is what the life of vlogger I won't get the nerve in a few moments later a few inches later I'm gonna have to update you in my recovery video, but I'm literally going in now. So they put a chair for me, I can't even record that because I've got to put my phone away. But I'll see you guys. Three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time cards. Hi guys, so I have had my surgery. This is what I look like. The nurse is looking at me like I'm crazy. <sighs> Um, my cousin bought me some fruits. There we go. I have got these cannulas in my hand and they're so painful. I hate these things with depression. I need to take my medication, so I've got some paracetamol here. I'm gonna take that and I'm gonna relax now. So So guys, here's my dinner. I'm gonna drink this smoothie. Let me try and take it out of the bag. They're legit having a party next door. Six and a half hours later. So guys, I'm awake and I'm about to have my porridge. I'm sitting up in the chair. Um, I've had a bar. What else have I had? Yeah, so this is what I'm doing right now. 
be. Got a bit of hot chocolate here. And some porridge. And I'll probably have it with some grapes. So this is what breakfast is looking like. I haven't brushed my teeth yet. Probably should do that very soon. And some leftover stuff from yesterday. A few moments later. Guys, it's my lunch time and I've already dug in. I've been jacket potato cheese with a little bit of bacon. Obviously apple juice and some grapes. So that's what I'm going to have. I still haven't touched this drink that my cousin bought me which is really bad but yeah waiting to go upstairs still so i can actually fall asleep properly <laughs> a few moments later mm, the special treatment yeah so guys i've got my dinner a bit of salad and she gets special treatment compared to other patients so yeah so. special treatment yeah With a bit of pizza can't go wrong and some ice cream thank you babe eternity later so guys, I'm on a new ward. I'm so tired. I'm gonna get free. This is my medication. my brother's house, grandma's house, to relax and have a nice hot bath and to rest and rest and rest a little bit more. several days later hi guys um so i've literally been on what days it's been five days um i just wanted to show you like i don't know if you can see but i've got like a few bruises from where i've had these things i'm still in bed i'm resting i am resting um, some of the content that you would have seen on Instagram literally pre-recorded a week, two weeks ago. Anything that I post now is all pre-recorded apart from these little bits that I'm adding in and the day of the surgery. I don't feel too bad. It's a bit of a struggle for me to talk too much. I was feeling my neck not too long ago and I touched a part and it really hurts. So I'm due to take some pain medication. I am still quite um, feeling a bit constipated as well, but that's due to the medication. I'm gonna have some fruit um, and drink some more teas to help it come out of my system. The medication, I don't feel like I'm feeling anything at the moment, but they said it's not gonna kick in until a good few weeks from now. I'm hoping the stitches dissolve very soon. But yeah, this is what I look like. Mum at home, high on drugs, literally. Um, but yeah, I will be doing um, some reviews of the medication and then also updates with a three month and also a six month update. So guys, sorry, it's hurting a lot right now. Follow, subscribe and all of that good stuff. Stay blessed and look after yourselves. Peace out.